YouTube, it's me, Sporty Dolphin, and in my last video I said I would try to make an iPad dock, and I have. It's not very, like, small or compact, but it'll do the do job, especially if you want to have sort of a laptop. Uh, then you could use this and attach a Bluetooth keyboard, and you have, like, a kind of a homemade laptop. So you're, what the things you're going to need are... 12 10 by 1 pieces just like this and 13 uh 8 by 1 pieces just like that and there's one more of these than these for a reason then over here you're going to need a 16 by 32 base plate i just used gray because it's the first one i could find and of course an ipad so going over here what you're going to do is you're going to take your base plate and I'm going to move the iPad over here and just lay it out like that then you take a 10 by 1 piece and you put it like that you take a 8 by 1 piece put it like that then you take the 10 by 1 piece and put it over where the 8 by 1 used to be that it sticks out a little bit and I'm not going for looks I mean I mean maybe it'll give it kind of like a cool look but I'm not trying to go for any kind of look then you're going to take an 8 by one and stick it like this so that when you turn it and you see right here you can see it's kind of like bricks and you're going to continue in that fashion until you have six layers right now I have two but you need six. So as soon as you have six, this is what it should look like. And as you can see over here, it's like bricks. Well, it's, you can't really see it very good on the camera. But you can see, oh, see, see like that? That's a piece coming from that side. And like that and that. Anyway, do you see what I mean? Like bricks. And then you're going to do the same for this corner start with a 10 by 1 piece like that it's kind of like a mirror image and you're going to do the exact same thing until you have six layers once again so as soon as you have six layers on both sides just like the bricks that I showed you uh, it should look like this um, and I know it doesn't look done yet and I'll show you what's going to happen if you're actually doing this, which I'm going to assume three quarters of you are not, you're just watching this, uh, you're going to notice that you have one 8 by one piece left. This is going to be, so the iPad, oops, so the iPad when it sits like this, it doesn't slide off. And it doesn't look very good, but we're going to make some adjustments. So you're just going to put this like somewhere like right there just so that when you put the iPad in it doesn't fall, it's pretty sturdy um, and if you can always like adjust it so like if you wanted if you wanted this to be more like upright then you would want, instead of moving this back these come off really easily you would take them and put them like as close near here as possible because then um, this won't flip like that, and that would be kind of bad because it might damage the iPad. So then, um, so then it's basically like that. It works, and I did 16 by 32 base plate purposely so that it would fit really snugly like that. And uh, you can make these closer, or it doesn't matter. You could even put it. Well, let's see if you can put it as upright as it will go. Yeah, you can. And it doesn't doesn't fall. Yeah, you can see my camera in the reflection. Uh, so now, I guess I'm going to show you how it looks with like a Bluetooth keyboard. and Maybe it'll look like an actual computer and maybe it won't. So this is what it'll look like with a Bluetooth keyboard. It looks a little bit like a computer, but not a whole lot. You can have it 
landscape or upright as I showed you. Uh, kind of gives you a computer feel, you know. Um, you could have this leaning back more. You would just have to push these, like, back here. Yes. So, uh, yeah, this is basically it for this video. Uh, so now I've made a dock for iPod and iPhone and a dock for iPad. And this is also great for watching movies. Uh, so, rate, comment, subscribe as always. I'll subscribe back or reply to the comments. Thanks for watching. See you next time, next video.